Hey, Elin, well met friends, and Dang here for another episode of Helm's Deep as we make our way through the amazing zone that Turbines crafted when we last left off. We are bringing God soup, and also finding swords, and now the God cheers, because apparently these people actually like us. Kind of. They kind of like us. And so they're actually repaying us for our extremely hard efforts as a champion that's traveling all over Middle Earth, and actually repaying us with cheers and stuff. Which is good. Definitely more than the average citizen in Middle Earth Kips. And hopefully this will be a continuing trend because it is very nice is much to, be done. to see soldiers cheering for you. Alright. I see that you have been busy helping around town. Your assistance is appreciated. It is now time that we work towards breaking through this siege. I need your help. You have returned. The Thane has not been met. And... The gods have are fed. Now, it is time to help with more pressing matters. You probably should have read the other cinematic first. Anyway, let's continue along. Ending. I have a task for you. The enemy is a pe it has a perimeter outside the town, and neither of our forces seem to make much progress against the other. I know there are many more of the White Hand out there, supporting the siege. If they bolster the perimeter, we could be caught unprepared. What I need is more information about the su those supporting this siege, and if more reinforcements are coming. I have seen messengers among their troops, who are very likely to have the information I seek. Intercept one, and learn what you may from him. All right. Oh, another quest. Ending. There is much to be done if we are to break this siege. A nasty Uruk named Nagas is out among the perimeter and appears to be leading the siege efforts. This one will not be easy to defeat. So should you choose to help us rid of him, you may need a friend or two to aid in such a task. Ha! Huh, I need not friends. I'm a champion. Only need friends when there's raids. Okay. Let's head out. To this enemy camp. And destroy these warriors. <laughs> yes. You think you're so good, Tunlinding Warrior, but you are not. You're about to die. Well, I am a champion. And you are not either. Alright, hey, yes. Everyone in Brockbridge has prepared for a long siege. Despite any amount of preparation, however, there is always a need for more weapons. You should defeat Dunlending warriors in the perimeter around Brockbridge and collect their weapons. But hopefully your auto attacks do not kill complete before you are able to finish the quest decks. Alright, let's pick up these. Only six, so that means we only need a few more. Let's go ahead and take out the siege machines here. Oh, interrupted myself. Alright, here we go. There are ballistas shooting at the towns and Brockridge defenders. Towers and Brockridge defenders. They must be destroyed. <laughs> yes, I destroyed that one. You're welcome. There are three, supposedly. Let's take out this archer. Oh, three archers. Fantastic. Ranged, defending the ranged. Well, you're dead, lady. Now it's your turn. <laughs> yes. Now you're dead. Now for the final one. Aha, yes. You. You are the one that shall die. There we go. Now we can defeat the war machine. Fantastic. Alright, let's head on back towards this direction. Where there should be the final war machine. Ideally. Alright, let's see here. We got some Dunlending Warriors. There's Nagas. Come here, buddy. Oh, you have a lot of health, don't you? Yes, you do. Let's do that. And definitely that. And oh my goodness, I'm going to die. What did I get myself into? I'm going to focus down the warrior first. So 
that we can hopefully finish this off. <laughs> All right, buddy. You are soon to die. <laughs> mm, yes, told you. This could take a while, especially if he keeps knocking me out like he is. All right, got that done. Gonna use some of the buffs here. Mm, yes. All right, well, we got him a fourth down. So that's something. All right. All right. Yes, hopefully he does not become more powerful as we work him down here. Oh, hello. Thank you for that. I really needed it. Really. Time for healing number two. And three... Really should have applied that before going into this. Anyway, you know, slowly, hopefully, kind of, sort of working them down. Oh, that was bad. Should not have hit that button. It's going to be the source of a lot of sadness now. Right, let's try to heal here. <laughs> Maybe a couple friends would have been a good idea. Just perhaps. Possibly. Oh no. I really have to take out these warriors if I'm going to survive this. Oh no, 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 no. Yeah, I'm dead. Fantastic. Alright. Well, that was fun. We shall now return to take out Nagas once more. This time mounted. Perhaps might be a greater advantage. Although I don't know how I shall get into that camp while being mounted. But we shall try. Oh, rain of arrows. The perimeter of Brockbridge is crawling with squads of Dunlending archers. They make it very hard for the Rohirrim to make any progress against the siege and should be dealt with. Alright. Doesn't sound too hard to... Mm-hmm, <laughs> yes. I don't know if I'll be able to defeat Nagas unless there is another player here with me. So we shall see what is going on. Let's actually check and see if any of our friends are online, perhaps. And no. Fantastic. Right, there's three out of six. And four out of six. Hmm, <laughs> yes. Which is this archer captain? Have? Not too bad. Alright, let's take out the archers then. So we just have to take out two of these archer captain things. And four archers, and then we shall be good to go. So that's not too bad. Hmm, <laughs> yes. You shall die, archer. I do like it that they're now having enemies grouped together. It definitely does add to the fun. And difficulty. Alright, let's take out this warrior. Oh, there's a messenger. Perfect. <laughs> She'll die, messenger. Oh, and there's the other siege machine. Alright. And there's another archer captain. This is just very easy quest. See, I love it when everything is right where you want it to be. And you can just do it and get out and continue on with the story. Alright. Thankfully, he counts as a warrior. Or, never mind. He's a crude map carrier. That's what he counts as. <laughs> Alright, buddy. There we go. Time to take out the captain. You stand no chance, Dunlending Captain. <laughs> Warned you. Alright, time for this archer to fall. See, there's two siege machines over here. I could have got 
better bang for my buck. But oh well. Mm hmm. The perimeter is not as deadly as it once was. Until the White Hand sends more reinforcements. Mm, right. There we are. Time to destroy. Here we go. Destroying the war machines allows the towers to be manned without much risk. The defenders of Brockbridge have n now have a better chance to hold back the siege. Alright, let's try this guy one more time. This time we'll try to do mounted from the front. We'll see how that works. Hopefully better. Uh, okay, buddy. Yeah, I'm not sure I have a line of sight with him. And come on. Nope, don't think that's going to work. But we shall still try once more. <laughs> oh, great, got all the archers with me. This will be great. All right, you're next, Archer Captain. Wish they could not shoot through the captain to kill me. But, you know. Wish that NPCs could line aside other NPCs. That'd be kind of nice. But then I guess players would get in the way and it'd be terrible, I'm sure, somehow. Find a way to kill this fool. Alright. So I think my main problem last time was I did not kill the warriors first. I just have to kill the warriors first, no matter what. And I might want to switch to tanking stance, but you know, we'll try it this way. Hmm, yes. Right now we are finally on the main dude once more. Probably should have ate food going into this as well. Oh well! I'm just terribly underprepared. That'll work. This will be the hope token going. Because I have clearly infinite number of those. Cough. Get that off the cooldown. And attack with that. So hopefully we're kinda sorta starting to work him down. And I am still getting heals, so that's decent. Try to keep it full out. Alright. We are working him down. Hopefully we do not get interrupted by any more stupid people. Come on. We can do this. Hopefully. Probably not. Actually, probably a bit off way more than I can chew. Have any other healing things I do? Haha! <laughs> Very good. Glad I looked in my inventory. What's this do? Oh, yes! More damage. Fantastic. Oh no. Come on, let me stun him. Can I stun him? 
I can stun him. <sighs> Thank goodness. Ooh, this heals me. This heals me. No. Nope. <sighs> oh well. It's good to know that that heals me now, though. That will help out, I'm sure. Okay, we will try this one more time. Now that I know I have another healing skill, magically. That should actually help a lot. See, this is why the difficulty needs to be increased. So that you can actually learn your class, and understand what skills you have, and look for stuff that you need. Because right now, after the most recent update, at least for some classes, things are very easy. The only reason this quest is hard is because it's a small fellowship and I'm trying it solo. And could probably do it if I use the right skills. Alright, a sneaky way in to kill Nigas. the skill every single chance I get. Let's go ahead and get that on cooldown. Hopefully. How often I can use that skill? That's a good question. Alright. We shall take down this man. Hopefully. Probably not. We're probably gonna fail. <laughs> That's probably what's gonna happen. Alright. But we shall try nonetheless. There we go. Gotta heal off of that. That also helps. Killing people helps. Alright. Stop hitting me. Yes, there's a heal. There we go. Put you to sleep. Mm, yes. It's probably better to stun this guy than anything else. Any chance I get at least. Come on. Now <laughs> we'll see how you like to be stunned, huh? Yeah, I bet you don't like it. I sure don't. Hmm. <laughs> That's good. Come on. There we go. To stun him as much as I can possibly stun him. Because it's very important to be stunned. Come on. Oh, goodness, come on. <sighs> That's so close. Come on, stun. Yes. Yep, I died again. Alright, I'm not going to try this again. Because, man, that's really hard. Alright, well, anyway, we're going to go ahead and cancel that quest. And maybe do it someday of never. Alright. There was more healing stuff in that loot. That could have had. Oh well. Don't interrupt me, Wolf. <laughs> Put weapons into Brodica's cache. Enemies patrolling or holding the line were thinned out. And you helped restock Rockbridge's weapon supplies by salvaging their weapons. You should help. S this should help sway the battle in the defender's favor. I need your help. This is an interesting but crudely drawn map. These orcs are using some kind of symbolism to represent the area's features and our defenses. 
I will need to study this to determine what it all means. One distinguishing marking on here represents a very large force of white hand nearby. We must... That must be the support behind this endless siege. Perhaps my fears are coming true. That, unsto that an unstoppable force is bearing down upon us. We have stood toe-to-toe -to -toe with the enemy for some time now, and have managed to force this stalemate. They are receiving supplies and reinforcements, and it seems they are setting the stage for an assault. I fear that when the hammer comes down, we will not have the men or supplies to withstand it. War drums can be heard in the distance. My worst fears are coming true, and they march on us in force. Please, aid our defense! Alright. Alright, well, thank you guys so much for watching another episode of Helm's Deep. When we return, we will aid to the defense of the city, and hopefully... It will still stand by the end of next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you again real soon for another episode of Helm's Deep. PVMP and Dang, subscribe.